back everybody so we've been moving down this long and lonely road I guess and I had to stop here I've got a ways to go still um, and actually this seems to be the perfect start perfect spot to stop uh, I'm gonna build a little house here uh, another rest area Mainly because I'm running out of materials. I, uh, this takes a lot more material than you would imagine. Or maybe you wouldn't if you got a good imagination. But I need to... Uh, I'm actually running out of cobblestone. I've got a stone, a stone brick. But the cobblestone is uh, a little light. So I thought I would build out just a small small little house here and then do some mining you won't see the mining part but you'll see me build the house so like this And I've got some wood. I've been cutting down a few trees. And actually, let's go check. Uh, see if all these leaves have despawned yet. Yes, so I've got some more trees here. Some more apples. There we go, that's a... We got six. I did pick up a bunch more earlier, so let's replant so I can come back and harvest. There's a lot of trees around here, so that's good for uh, what I need. But you see, I've been doing this pattern uh, with half slabs. I think it comes out pretty good. 
it's better than just a plain flat uh, one one style so so let's one two three um, this tree is gonna have to go I was hoping I wouldn't need to cut this one down but it's in my way We go one, two, three, one, two, three, one, three. Actually, <laughs> that mistake worked out pretty good. Kind of like it with the little jut out there. And we will use the birch as well. And like I said, this is going to be a tiny little place. This is almost too small. I need room for a bed and some chests. So maybe if I push it back, can I push it back one more? Maybe I'll just make it one more farther back. Like this. And actually, that would be okay too, because I think I'm going to dig down here, straight down, and just do some strip mining. So. I can put uh, some chests over here and then a doorway out right there and then my strip mine can start here. My tunnel down is going to be a two by two. And then the ladder will go down there. Okay, so we got this. There and got the floor. So let's just use these birch planks. I don't have any glass. So either I need to find some sand. Or I'm just going to go without. So I think that'll be okay there. Take that crafting bench. So if I put the crafting bench in that corner there, then I just need to make a roof. Oh, and I still got these leaves in my way. Yeah, I definitely want to put windows in here. For now, where's my dirt? There's my dirt. So we will just do this. Just because this is a quick and dirty build doesn't mean you don't uh, 
build it as nice as you can. I think I want to do that. That way I can put another layer here. And the benefit of having the high peak on the roof here means the ceiling is going to be high and I can stack up like uh, furnaces and that kind of stuff. I think I'm going to run out. Yes, I ran out. Do I have a torch? I don't even have any torches. Put that torch there. Um, let's put a torch here. Oh, I better get some sleep before uh, I'm in real trouble. Where's my bed? Oh, there's bed. Okay, so should be able to finish this up real quick. Like that. Let's put that there. And I'm being pretty free with the use of these uh, oak logs because, look, endless supplies. There we have it. Let's get down, take a look at it. I do need a door. So we'll make a door and I think what is going to substitute for windows. So for the window, I'm going to put those there. Like that. So we have the door in. And you get in here, this will take you to downstairs and then over here I'm going to have some furnaces probably and then a little bit of storage doesn't need to be long-term storage oh and I need to move the bed inside I will have to go probably make another bed once I start traveling again got the bed they got room for more chests, and the chests can go up quite a ways. Three high at least. Maybe some more over the top if I need to. I don't I don't see me storing that much. Because I'm just harvesting it so I can use it to finish this. Let's put uh, that there. Yeah, so I think that looks good. 
get back here, take a look. Yeah, I think that's pretty good. I still need to do uh, lighting on the sides of the road here. I just want to take a look at from the bottom of the hill. Pretty inviting rest area, so anyone traveling on the road, once I get done here, can use it to um, stay overnight. Like there's anyone else around here besides me, but I am trying to make a like a functional world, so this is one step. Just a couple more lights, and I think we're good. So I'm going to uh, do some strip mining and uh, get enough resources to continue the road, because I think I stopped right down there. And it goes on for a ways. I'm hoping to get this all done. Well, yeah, I'll get this all done in this episode. This episode may take days to get done. But I'll show you, you know, like I did at the start where I showed you a few clips of me building the road this way. I'll grab a few more clips and show you 30 seconds or so. Condense it and show you going that way until we get to our destination. Which is, uh, I think, a very interesting place. It's a cool natural uh, phenomenon in the world that I decided to build a uh, outpost in. Uh, I haven't really built anything in it, so that's going to be our next big uh, finish job finisher, is putting houses and stuff in there. So I think uh, this will probably be the last you'll hear of me in this episode. I hope you uh, have a great day, and I will see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.